Hey, welcome brothers and sisters to my channel Faisal Azib. In this video, I will talk again more in detail about this vector file, the difference between EMF and SVG. I will show you what you can get with EMF file and SVG. We have to get the difference. So I have chosen some example. So remember, EMF file is for all version PowerPoint, but SVG is only for new versions since 2016. So it is new format. It is a lot more advantage to use it than EMF file. So I have download some uh, vectors from FreePick, like this one or this one, and I will try to convert them to EMF and SVG and use them to PowerPoint to see if you have problem or no. Okay, or what is the difference between them? So. I will convert them one by one. So let's go. Tag. I will start with this one. I think EPS to the Illustrator. Oops, I will close this one. Sorry. I will close this one and I will open it again. EPS. Now I will convert it to UMF. Format. Remember, it's file, export, export as, and here I will use uh, emf test, okay, export. I will make the same thing to svg, but I will go to the save as here, save as, svg, and I will take svg test. So let's see if we have difference or no between them. Yeah, okay. There's our PowerPoint. What are the two files? So let's start with EMF. Drag and drop. Now I will make a group. A group. Yeah. Do you see what I have? That is a good example. Look at this uh, white color behind the shape, any shape. It is not like the, what is the first one? Like this. There is a difference between them. Do you see? Here we have white here, white from here. It is not good. So it is not like original format. It is uh, the problem is EMF. So remember this rule. If you don't change, if the, you will not change the the vector and you have EMF file, let it, let it, don't touch it, don't touch, okay, just use it directly. If you will not, it is not uh, necessary to, to make some, uh, some change or you need some uh, element from this uh, vector, let it, just let it and use it when you bring it to PowerPoint directly. Now let's see with the second file, with SVG, if what we have, when we use it in PowerPoint. So I will take it, remember it is the new format for the vectors, so now a group, do you see, it is a little bit uh, good than the MF file, yes we have this uh, the shadow from here, but it is not like the previous one. There are some difference, so here we can get our element, I think very easy than the previous one. All the, the element can be uh, used directly, as you can see, uh, the text, etc, etc, I cannot do the previous one. We have a lot of, lot of uh, white in our vector. So SVG, it is a new format, remember. I recommend you to use this format if you have uh, this version of PowerPoint. Maybe you don't because you need uh, to extract some information from your vector to use them in other uh, slides or anything else. So try to use SVG. I have shown exactly the difference. You can use, for example, I have uh, this one, this uh, example. We get the same thing from, from this uh, shape of this element. We have the same problem. So. Remember, SVG is 
higher than EMF, but it is for the complex object. If you have the simple object, like this one, for example, if you have uh, this element, so let's take, let's uh, close this one and take simple object that I have downloaded from uh, icon, flat icon, for example, uh, school bus, this one. This simple icon here you will not see a difference. So you can use UMF file, no problem, export, export as school bus, UMF school bus. Here you will see there is no problem with what is it? UMF school bus. So if I am going to the PowerPoint, you will not lose anything here. So in group, yeah, just the color, no problem about the color, but about uh, the shape or the element it is not a problem. So you can use them directly as you can see, all the elements are good, no problem, because this simple, simple vector, okay? Color, you can correct again, no problem. If color, it is not a problem. You can use it uh, like from here. You need to color again your uh, element. You know, do this shape format, shape field, etc. etc. Okay, it's so simple. So, if you have a complex vector, use SVG format. But if you have a small vector, like the icon, or anything else, you can use EMF format. See you in the next video, inshallah, to see a new thing. Practice and show me if you have uh, any problem with this uh, type of uh, element or vector. Tell me in the comment you have, if you have problems. How when you convert uh, some vectors, you got a big difference between uh, your original and the, the new one. Tell me this in the comment. Practice, always practice. Be, take, try to use your imagination or your inspiration. It's very, very important. Okay? It is not about illustrator, but it's about design slide. Try to use your imaginations to get what you want. Take care of us. We say goodbye. Assalamu alaikum wa barakatuh.